Hi, this is a small introduction to a kit with a lot of sensor of Arduino. Actually, I got this one from a friend of mine. He gave me this kit that he bought on eBay. I will show where you can find. Uh, actually, this is a 37 in one sensors. This is the name of the kit. And there are a lot of sensors that I will introduce and I will make lesson for each of the sensor to see how to work with them and what we can get out of them. But first uh, I found this on eBay. This is a similar kit. It's called Ultimate 37 in one sensor modules kit for Arduino and MCU with box. The seller is, here is Bob Bobo way to way okay so let's go a little over the sensor uh, not all of them are in the kit I will explain and uh, as I said I will make a movie for each of the sensor in the coming weeks okay so let's start this is a thermometer this is a kind of a resistor that change its resistance during the change of the temperature here we will work with it and see how we can get data from it we have here also this is a kind of uh, I guess infrared something I'm not I don't really know what it is but we will see later what we can do with it. I think it is a, a transmitter and receiver, but I'm not sure. Also, there is a LED here. We will test it later. We have here, this is like a joystick, like in PlayStation. I can see that there are two resistors and also a button, so we can change the movement and by the movement do something in our program we'll see how to work with it also here I have this is a gas sensor that can uh, see if there is a botan gas or other gases we will see later how to do with it also here I have a microphone, probably this is a microphone with an amplifier that we can sense sound and put them in the Arduino. Here I have a potentiometer, but this is not a regular one. This is a digital potentiometer. We will see how to work with it. Here I have, it's look to me again like infrared. This is like of the infrared using in car that can track a paint, a black paint and know if we are walking on a specific path or not. This is, this looks to me like RGB LED. So we can light it red, green, and blue, and also all the other by mixing the signals of the LEDs. This looks to me like a tilt, or I'm not sure about it, like a tilt sensor that can uh, determine if there is a tilt. I'm not sure what this is, but it's looked to me like a thermometer, something like this. We will test it. This one is a magnetic sensor that can sense magnet when it is near it 
and it close a circle. You will see it also. This looks to me like infrared. It's a receiver or transmitter. I'm not sure. This one is a whole effect sensor. We will talk about it. This one is a photo photo cell that can determine the amount of light. This one is just a regular push button. This is not in this kit, but it is a LCD display like they use in uh, small phones. We will work with, with it also. This is a piazza buzzer that makes sounds. This one, we already talked, this is all effect sensor. This is a relay. If you would like to connect high voltage and high ampere, like let's say connecting and disconnecting a 220 volt light bulb, we must use this one. This is an ultrasonic sensor. There is a receiver and transmitter. We can use it to determine the distance from an, an object. Okay, these are not coming in this kit, but we will also talk and see what we can do with them. This one is the Ethernet interface, so we can make our own HTML pages like HTML server that the Arduino will transmit data out through the Ethernet. This one is also not in the kit. This is a GSM module that we can put a SIM card and actually connect to cellular provider and send data and get data. This one is also not in the kit. This is a GPS. We can use it as a GPS and get data from satellite and determine where, where we are. This one is a interface for SD card. It also has a battery so I guess there is a real-time clock in it. We will talk about real-time clock. Okay, thank you for now.